This is episode 26 of Good News TV. Is it 26? I feel like it is. Okay. As always, I'll be bringing a piece of local good news, national good news, and global good news from around the world this week um, and the, the last few weeks, really, just to, just to constantly show that good things are happening all the time all around us. So, piece of local good news this week is actually about me. Bit nervous, but I thought. But actually, is this a good piece of news? So let's choose it. Um, I ran a marathon this week just gone. It was the hardest thing I've ever done, but one of the best things I've ever done as well. And that was to raise money for a local school called Robin Park Schools. They are schools for children with disabilities and learning difficulties. And I was raising money for specifically their adventure park, which really tragically has been it vandalized by some people so they have to replace all of the equipment uh, within it so and, and it's expensive they said that every penny counts so i had lots of donations donations from wonderful people friends family strangers and raised a whopping 505 pounds for rowan adventure park so yeah that was the the main thing that kept me going during that 26.2 miles but you know, again, just an example that good things can come from sad things. We all have it within us to do something good. It doesn't always have to be something like a marathon. It can be a really small act of kindness um, and it goes a long way. So that's a piece of local good news. A piece of national good news is about students in Ireland. So they have saved 1.5 million batteries from landfill across Ireland. So this is people specifically at Roundwood National School in Wicklow and they rescue batteries so they can rescue the valuable materials within them so they can be recovered for reuse. So that's a staggering amount and um, that would have essentially just been left around people's houses and you know kind of disposed of as like litter maybe or left the landfill. So that's an amazing work by people across Ireland and as a result of that they've been given um. 2,000 euros in sports vouchers for their commitment to sustainability. So well done to everyone that was taking part in that. And the piece of global good news this week is that Lisbon has been voted Europe's best culinary destination. Um, I was looking at all the food when it was talking about this article and it was making me really hungry and really wanting to go to Lisbon because I've never been. Um, so it's said to be this is said because the gastronomy um, is one of tourists' most important factors when they're looking for holiday destinations. And it's been long recognised, Lisbon specifically, uh, for its um, diverse and high quality foods offer. So it includes a range of food offers from typical and local restaurants to also like more signature restaurants and Michelin star restaurants as well. Um, so well done Lisbon for winning that award. I'm sure it was very well deserved. I feel like I need to come and try all of your wonderful food that you have to offer. And yeah, if anyone's looking for a holiday destination, then get over to Lisbon and try some of their um, lovely food options. So they are the pieces of good news from this week. I'm going to be attaching the links as I've been doing in the most recent videos. I am also going to attach the link to the Just Given page for Rowan Adventure Park where they are also raising funds online as well to help um, restore their lovely park for the children to access. So yeah, if anyone's got any spare pennies, please feel free to donate. And as always, I hope you are entering into the awesome with a smile, receiving good news, despite things that may be happening across the world. 99% of things are good, positive and uplifting. We just need to look for them a little bit more. So thank you for listening. Bye.